America's solidarity with Taiwan is crucial. And that is the message we are bringing here today. Nancy Pelosi's visit to Taiwan is controversial because these high level visits from government officials from other countries are seen to give Taiwan some legitimacy. China considers Taiwan as part of its own territory. And so it feels that these visits will allow Taiwan to establish itself as separate from China. And China, from the very start, had said that they did not want this visit to happen. They did not want Nancy Pelosi on Taiwan soil. 30 minutes after Nancy Pelosi landed in Taiwan, China announced they were going to do these massive military drills. And they made sure that Taiwan and the rest of the world knows that this is not just the regular military exercises that they do to flex their muscles. This is something much more, and it is worrying the Ministry of Defense here. The One China policy is there's one Chinese government, and at one point that was the government that was sitting here in Taiwan, but that became the government sitting in Beijing, and that is now the government that the United States recognized, which means that that government in Beijing, with the Chinese Communist Party's government, will be representing China. And in this case, this China includes even this part of the world, Taiwan, which is why a lot of countries have to choose or are forced to choose between diplomatic relations with Beijing or diplomatic relations with Taipei. The US has a, an act, uh, a law which requires it by law to help Taiwan defend itself and protect itself should it be invaded. So it's that fine line that the U.S. is balancing. What will happen to the U.S.-China relations from here? Yes, you know, most likely a lot of heated words, a lot of rhetoric. The U.S. will condemn China for taking that kind of military action, for intimidating Taiwan. Uh, if China takes it further, then that is a different question because if China takes it into that 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 territory of where it's going to be conflict with Taiwan, then relations have completely broken off.